In this video, I'm snowboarding in Park City. It's Martin Luther King's Day weekend and I've traveled here with family and friends. Park City is a huge mountain with two sections, a mountains village and a canyons village section. We are skiing in the mountains village section, the main Park City ski area, which is closer to the historic Park City where there are many great restaurants. Uh, Park City is owned and operated by Vail Resorts, which is growing its ski, as, uh, ski resorts portfolio through acquisitions. You can ski all week with these two mountains connected to each other. In these clips, I'm snowboarding with my daughter on the learning trail, first timer. This is a good green trail, a huge green trail, with a chairlift at the base of the mountain. There were a few ma magic carpet areas close by for beginners. There are many lessons on the first timer trail, but it's very wide and, and there's enough space for everyone. My daughter is eight years old and she's enjoying the trail a lot and was able to go up the chairlift on her own accord. There were two other girls in our group on this trip, so they had fun skiing uh, together with us. The conditions were amazing with powder and snow. I did not see much ice on the mountain even though there were a lot of visitors. And the views were amazing as you can see in these clips. Because it was a long holiday weekend, everything was a little more expensive and there were a lot of people on the mountain. At the trails, at higher levels, it was spacious and not too crowded, but at some locations it can get congested, and you have to be careful not to get hit. Believe it or not, I was hit twice from behind by one skier and one snowboarder. Uh, they host an annual Sundance Festival in Park City, so if you visit, try to avoid that weekend, which can get even more crowded and even more expensive. There are many restaurants in Park City to try out, but make sure to have reservations ahead of time. During our trip, our first night here, we had no reservations and we got takeout food from the Bangkok Thai on Main and we ate it at our B&B. It was good. We also had sit-down dinners at Grappa, an Italian restaurant, and Grub Steakhouse. I've also visited the High West Distillery. For lunch, instead of eating at the main dining hall, we ate at a restaurant called Baja Cantina near the, ba near the main base lodge, good Mexican food. Park City is about 50 minutes from, Park, from the Salt Lake City Airport. It's convenient for us, we flew in directly from Boston and rented a car and an Airbnb with friends. On the day you arrive, you can even try to squeeze in an afternoon on the slopes. There are a ton of other ski resorts in the area, but I like Park City. My wife and I have come here before and had an excellent time, so we've come, we've come back with friends. Share this with any friends visiting Park City soon. I hope you liked this video. If you did, please click like, comment, or subscribe. Please check out my other snowboarding videos on my channel.